Across the country, this month of April marks National Donate Life Month. Right now in Florida, there are more than 5,000 people waiting for a life-saving organ, including young children. For the family of a 13-year-old boy in Tampa, a match cannot come soon enough. As Fox 13's Jordan Bowen reports, his family just discovered last week he has a rare heart condition and now is in urgent need of a heart transplant. He just is so happy running around, playing, just like any other 13-year-old right now. Victor Cruz just celebrated his 13th birthday on March 16th. His sister Louise says he seemed happy and healthy, but days later, all that changed. He was throwing up. He couldn't keep anything in his system. And after maybe like 30 minutes after eating, he would just throw up. He was just not feeling good. He was very quiet, very calm. He usually isn't. He's very up and active and playing. The next day, their mom took him to the doctor who told them to go to the hospital. They immediately started running tests and found fluid in his abdomen caused by a heart condition they never knew he had called dilated cardiomyopathy. His heart rate was up to the 140s and he was just laying there. He wasn't even moving around or anything. They were like, well, his heart is overworking. His heart is stressed out. That's when he was flown by helicopter to UF Health Shands Children's Hospital in Gainesville. He's now on a ventilator and heavily sedated as he and his family desperately wait for a matching donor to get a heart transplant. It could be a week, it could be days, it could be months, or it could be years just while he's waiting on the um, list. Until then, his sister says there is a device doctors can put on his heart to make it so he can leave the hospital and wait comfortably at home for a matching donor. But for now, doctors are still monitoring him at the hospital. Finding a heart from a deceased donor to match a 13-year-old isn't as easy as finding an adult donor because child deaths only account for about 2% of all deaths. Louise says she and her family are praying and hoping for a miracle. It would mean everything to all of us because we love him so much. Much. And obviously we we want the best for him and he hasn't had a chance to do much. You know, he's just 13. He has so much more to do. Reporting in Tampa, Jordan Bowen, Fox 13 News.